at around 5.20 a.m. this morning and that's how KCR is particular about uh, the auspicious timing you had uh, the Telangana Chief Minister stepping into his palatial bungalow come off it. It's a complex which is made uh, with over 50 crore expenditure. Here's a look at uh, Telangana Chief Minister's latest splurge. Telangana Chief Minister K. Chandrasekhar Rao is all set to move into his dream home. The Chief Minister and his wife perform the housewarming ceremony in his new home, Pragati Bhavan, which will also serve as his official building. As a part of the ceremony, prayers from all the religions also took place. The fortress-like home of the Telangana Chief Minister sprawls over 1 lakh square feet with more than 50 personal guards keeping watch on it. Known for his bizarre expenditures, this time KCR has got his bathrooms and bedrooms fitted with bulletproof glass. This bungalow is unique as the entire bungalow has made uh, bulletproof by the officials. This bungalow has spread in almost over 1 lakh square uh, feet area. Uh, this bungalow has 200 vehicle parking apart from all modern amenities. Rao is also known to enjoy his Z plus security status when he travels. The chief minister replaced his old convoy of Toyota Fortuners with Toyota Land Cruiser Prados. Bureau Report, India Today. So let me go across to my colleague Ashish who is joining us. Uh, look at this. This is how the palatial complex was inaugurated uh, today morning by KCR. And uh, you have a lot of uh, sages who are coming uh, with KCR as he's going around his palatial bungalow, which also has uh, an auditorium, which also has a bulletproof bathroom. And it's all built over the cost of 50 crore rupees. Um, Ashish, uh, as we're seeing these uh, visuals of Telangana Chief Minister inaugurating his bungalow and stepping in with his uh, family, the question is uh, how much more splurge will we see from the Chief Minister whose state is in dire need of funds? The farmers are, are suffering from drought as well. You have KCR spending on white car fleets because uh, his astrologer says it's auspicious. The entire secretariat will be renovated again at the cost of 150 crore. That's also because the astrologer of KCR has said that it should be Vastu compliant. Definitely, Devina. Uh, uh, this is the bigger question that time and again uh, the government is coming out uh, with the decision of building or removing or or creating new structure, uh, and they are just uh, they are they are uh, demolishing all those structures who are not Vastu compliant. Uh, this this uh, government and particularly the CM is known for his inclination and knowledge towards the Vastu, and that's why today uh, CM uh, entered into a new bungalow, the old uh, CM house come official complex was built in 2005, the then uh, Chief Minister uh, Y.S. Raj Shekhar Reddy had built that uh, bungalow, that's not uh, very old, that bungalow has all the basic facility, but since uh, that bungalow as per, as per the, this government, as per the CM, as per the astrologers, that bungalow doesn't uh, have that proper vastu. So this government came out with an idea of getting a new bungalow. Now uh, CM uh, K. Chandrasekhar Rao, along with his minister son K. Tarak Ramarao, today uh, morning at, uh, at 5.22 uh, a.m. entered into a new bungalow. Now the controversy is the costing and the expense. Uh, the exchequer, definitely public exchequer, uh, opposition is realizing that public exchequer uh, being mis misused. That's why uh, the joint action committee of opposition party Parties are holding a dharna today. They are against this kind of uh, pomp and show uh, uh, of, of the government, and they are also questioning at the time when government uh, is is, uh, is uh, saying that they don't have enough money. At the time when Telangana uh, state farmers are committing suicide, Telangana is known as a, a, a distress farmer distress state. At the time of, of there are less job creation. 
why cm is doing all these kind of uh, money this kind uh, of extravagance ashish of this kind of uh, extravagance by telangana chief minister is not only questionable but also unpardonable uh, at a time when farmers are distressed committing suicide in the case it's written with drought the money can be utilized for better purposes although telangana chief minister has uh, maintained that much of it's uh, been used from his personal finances but he can do much more with that kind of money